What is going on ladies and gentlemen, in this video it's going to be really short, I'm just going to give you the TLDR on how I got banned and why I am now unbanned. And a spoiler alert, uh, there are some bad apples in the bunch boys, but uh, for real, leave the devs alone on this one. The devs had nothing to do with my ban. To the contrary, because of the devs, can't mention names, I was pulled out of the fire. They manually lifted my ban. Not only did they manually lift my ban, but they gave me six months of ESO plus, uh, which is pretty nice. And plus, what are 1650 times two is 30, 3300 crowns to boot. So, um, how did this happen? So the reason I got banned is because my most recent video, which I've had to take down in order to comply with the ZOS, I agreed to unlist the video and all my socials uh, take it down as well so just so I am not quote unquote advertising bug exploits real or fictitious mind you the, the TOS was changed to include that clause real or fictitious so now the TOS states that you can't even claim you you have a bug or an exploit like you, you cannot be using those trigger words so anyone out there who's content creator Use those words very, very lightly. Reach out to the dev team first. Do a bug report. Do not make videos on them. They didn't tell me to say any of this, but I think you guys should know. But the reason I was banned was because a lot of people, some content creators, some of your favorite content creators, mind you, some of the crap poster content creators, a lot of members of the community weaponized the report system and mass reported that video. And that's really it. I'm not going to mention names because like my mom said, the more you start stirring and shit, Josh, the more you start smelling like it. I know who the whistleblowers are. I'm never going to be able to look at the ESO community again. All the friends and bridges I thought I built. Um, apparently I have not. So you guys wonder why I play solo. This is exactly why there are many two-faced people in this game really everywhere, but especially in ESO. So it's essentially, that's it. Uh, they, they pulled me out of the fire, gave me a nice slap on the ass. I get back out there, Horcrux, here's just six months of ESO plus, you know, 1700 crowns, whatever the 1650 times two is, 30, 3300 crowns, and I get back out there, champ. Again, let me reiterate, the devs have nothing to do with this, and it was a, just a bunch of degenerates in the community trying to be cute and trying to deplatform and, and, and trying to get me off the game like they, they, they had been for like the past year. It, it's nothing new. I expected this. But yeah, that's it. The live stream yesterday, uploaded short today. Um, Endless Archive is coming out very, very soon, and I cannot wait to be producing content on that. And boy, we are going to have some overpowered builds going forward in this patch, man, especially on the Dragonite. It's going to be fun. So if you haven't already, please like and sub. Go follow me on Twitch. I do stream over there four or five times a day as well on YouTube. And if you want to help support the channel, I do have YouTube memberships enabled as well as Patreon. So anyways, with all that being said, hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you on stream. Peace.